guys, it's Cara. Welcome back to the Mamatina channel. Today I am doing another mood blanket update because I changed it once again. I keep doing this, um, but no, this should be it now. Uh, but basically I have changed up the template of the blanket because I realised it wasn't the smartest way to lay out um, the blanket because it was getting very confusing and a lot of people were asking me, you know, where are the flowers going? And I understand that it looks really confusing um, on my TikTok. So I was looking at it the other day and I noticed that there is a diagonal pattern that I could have been doing. So I was like, you know what? I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna um, reposition the flowers to be in the correct order in this new template. So I spent like four hours yesterday redoing it and I, I should just like roll the clips now of me in the process of doing that. So yeah. I'm gonna redo this. Um, so I've got 42 days here um, and I was looking at it the other day and I noticed, look, you've got these like nice diagonal lines. I can't believe I only just realized until now. Um, so I've redrawn the template. So you start one, two, three, four, five, six and do diagonal lines like that. I think that's gonna be so much easier. It just means I have to redo it. Um, yeah, I think I would prefer to do that method because the other day I was looking at it and I was trying to work out like what mood, what pattern my moods were going in. And it's really hard to read the, my template that I was using before where it was one, two, three, four, five, six, like it can get a bit jumbled. I was trying to go back on myself and it was really difficult to work out. So I was looking at it and I noticed I could have gone one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, and just go in these diagonal lines. Um so yeah, I'm gonna have to re I'm just gonna spend today redoing it um and i'm gonna have to update my tiktok as well which is fine because i'm like four days behind anyway um because i've had a few extremely low days some really rough days so i haven't been able to crochet at all so i'm gonna spend the whole of today redoing this uh, um but in the correct order and it, i'm gonna be so much happier afterwards because then i can actually see the pattern of my moods like this i think it would just make it so much more sense so yeah i'm so sorry to everyone who has started this blanket um with the template i was using before um but obviously you don't have to change it if you don't want to um this is just this is just something with crochet and any other creative hobby or um you know there's a lot of trial and error um, in designing a project. So I'm, yeah, redesigning this. And I know for the future, if I wanna make a mood blanket like this again next year, I know to start like this. Um, so yeah, I'm really sorry to everyone who started a blanket already. Um, yeah, carry on doing whatever you wanna do, what feels right for you. Um, this is just what feels right for me, which is a shame because I have to redo it. But I'm gonna take apart this gradually as I go so that I don't have to redo the middle bits I just have to redo the petals <laughs> uh, okay let's go do that so I've written down each colour for each day and now I'm just yeah taking it apart just the petal bit um, and reattaching them in the correct order. So just to make it clear, this is the first day and then the second day and then the third day. So I literally had to just swap these two over. So before it went one, two, three. Now it's going one, two, three. So then it can start this diagonal pattern. And I realized I didn't need to actually uh, detach this one from this because it, it's the same, you just rotate it, but it's fine. Now we're just gonna keep adding them on diagonally like this. I hope this makes sense um, 
But yeah, I'm just gonna figure out what colour I need to take and join them. So looking at the old template, the fourth is what I need to join next. So the fourth was up at the top here. So it's this one. And then obviously with my notes, it says that it's blue, gray for tired. So it's this one. Ah, this is kind of confusing, but with this new layout, it's gonna be so much less confusing <laughs> because you will be able to see The days will be next to each other whereas with my old pattern um they're kind of a bit more spread out um yeah like for example you've got like 24 and 25 a sit that you know are like next to each other like sitting quite close to each other and then 26 you jump across so yeah, writing out each day was getting confusing because I was like, you have to go from here to then here, here. No, that's not that's not right. I kept messing up here. It was pebble pink and then I think it went to here, then here. And then, so yeah, it was just getting very confusing. So this new template I'm very happy with. And yes, I think this will make a lot more sense to a lot of you as well. So <laughs> I was overcomplicating it before. And I didn't realise that there was a diagonal pattern within this pattern. So yeah, I hope I'm not confusing anyone. <laughs> I feel like I'm confusing myself trying to explain it, but yeah. Okay, I have joined six days together now. Um, so yeah, one, two, three, four, five, six. So it goes one, two, three, four, five, six. And now I'm going to move up to seven, which is here. So you're adding to every diagonal row. So it started off with two, then four, then six. Yeah, ah, this is how it's going. Okay, let's keep going. Hopefully I can get this all done today. I might not be able to and do my new ones and catch up and film TikToks for those. I don't think I'm going to be able to do that all today because of oh, the daylight as well. <laughs> but now, yeah, so now I can look at the days next to each other like that, which makes so much more sense. And this is how the blanket looks like now. So yeah, very different. It looks a lot better and yeah, like the colours are all, the flowers are all in different spots now. Um, but yeah, so I hope this template makes a lot more sense it makes a lot more sense to me now um because now i just work diagonally um i'm actually like three days behind i think three or four three i think three um and it's super easy because now i just work diagonally this is really hard to hold up <laughs> um so next i will go here and then here and literally yeah just work diagonally or in a straight line like along, along here and then you add two on the end I don't know if I'm making any sense this is I don't know why I'm finding this so hard to explain um, maybe it'll be better to show you on my desk rather than me trying to hold it up so let me do that okay so my desk is actually too small to fit this blanket so i've got it here on my rug um but yeah this is what it looks like now the new template version uh you can see it here so yeah now i'm working in diagonals like this um it's a lot a lot easier and yeah, I hope you guys like the the new look. So yeah, thank you so much for watching this quick little mood blanket update. Um, yeah, again, I'm so sorry to anyone who started this blanket with the other template. Um, yeah, you're free to do whatever you want with this blanket. Um, to make it your own so yeah you could you could literally decide to put the flowers wherever you like that might be fun um 
but I'm such a perfectionist, I have to have it in order. Um, so yeah, I spent yesterday redoing it, but I'm really happy with it. So yeah, that's all for today. I'll update you again on this blanket in a few weeks or whatever. Um, so yeah, thank you so much for watching. Um, that's it. I don't know what to say. I'm, uh, you'd think I'd get better at these you know, talking in front of a camera and like intros and outros, but I'm still finding it really difficult. <laughs> but yeah, thank you so much. I always, I always over say that. I say that so much. Um, but yeah, I am truly grateful of you clicking on this video and liking it and then commenting on it. Um, yeah, it means so much to me. So I'm going to go now. <laughs> thank you so much. Oh, I've said it again. Anyway, happy crocheting. I'll see you in the next one. Bye. <laughs>